Hey guys, Ron here, and I just wanted to show you what I'm be uh, pulled out of storage, along with all my other toys. <laughs> is uh, this drone, and uh, this drone's going to be a lot of fun, and probably the topic for a bunch of videos in the future. Uh, it's got a mount for a camera on the front. Uh, it's pretty big. Uh, it's got a lot of power in these motors. I, I grabbed motors, uh, I don't know what size they are. I'm not really a radio control guy. But I got the biggest ones on the list of the available ones. We've been building this, I've been building this piece by piece. And I got it to a point where I'm ready to start testing it. Just need to get a couple of wires yet. Uh, but this is uh, something that I'll be using to uh, take pictures of uh, buildings that I'm researching, uh, local, uh, I work for, I've, I'm been working for a local uh, tech company building some uh, historical buildings and I just kind of think it would be fun if I got the, the helicopter view of the building as opposed to just taking pictures around, uh, from the ant's eye view. Uh, you know, like your the layouts. When you look at the layout, it's usually from above, and that's what where this can come in handy. So yeah, I got to get a couple more quick connects and uh, some more wire, and uh, then test out my lipo batteries and my lipo charging station. I gotta everything's all new to me in this, so uh, I gotta. Make sure I got everything figured out so I don't burn it out. I think I've got, uh, I need to upgrade my ESCs. I think they're, uh, I can't remember what, so, oh, 30 amp. But I think I'm going to need more, more than that because these, I forget how big these are, but I, I'm pretty sure that they're close to the 30 amps and I'm pretty sure that's how that works. I'm. It's quite possible that I'm wrong. But anyways, this is what I've been uh, working on today, well, as well as cleaning up the shop. See you later.